Hello friends, in the last tutorial we will discuss about what is CGI and the overview of CGI. We also learn a structure of CGI script. But in this tutorial we are coming on the topic of why CGI? What is the use of CGI and what CGI provides? CGI enables you to add interactive connect to your web pages. You can often use Java or JavaScript to make a web page interactive or CGI execute on the server and thus can access files and databases on a server as well. A CGI execute on the server and thus can access files and databases on the server as well. You can also use ASP for the same task as CGI. ASP is a proprietary product and so will only work on Windows server. CGI will work with almost all server on thus has more chances of working with what you have now and what you might change to later. It should be noted that the Windows version of Perl comes with an extension called Perl script that allows you to write ASP pages almost other things in Perl anyway. Of course, you use an ASP interface, not a CGI info interface, but the language is the same. Now we are come in the next topic that what CGI provides for us. CGI provides a way of executing an arbitrary program on the web server. This program can receive data from the web browser and send data back to the web browser. The CGI script receives data from the web browser and sends some data back. It cannot send some data and then wait for a reply. Now we see the data communication on a web and the CGI. First point is a web client program such as web browser can access data from many different servers such as Gopher, FTP, NNTP or HTTP. The HTTP server was designed specially for a web. It supports sending documents from the server to a browser and that can also support sending complex data from the client back to the server. There are four types of or a methods for a data communication. First is get and second is post. Get, what do you mean by get? The data are passed within the query string of URL. For example, we can access the URL. So accessing the URL is a get method of communication. Second method is post. The data are sent as a message body that follows the request message sent by the client to the server. It is known as post method of data communication. Above this tutorial, we will learn that data can be sent from the client browser to the HTTP server. The common gateway interface that means the CGI is the mechanism used by the most server to process this client data. 